Hey you guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Mink and of course this is Mink's Kinks. And y'all, y'all already see what time it is. Y'all read by the title already. It is a wash day video, but y'all already know the drill. If you are new around here, of course, go ahead, hit that subscribe button, join our kinky group family. We would love to have you. But yeah, so y'all see that Ms. Mama's hair is wet and I actually have a pre-poo in. So let me show y'all what it is. It is the Curls and Potions Chebe and Mint Clay Gloss. And y'all, it is from the length retention and conditioning um, section of their line. So there's a bunch of Ayurvedic herbs and everything. Let me give y'all a quick length check because it's giving, let me tell you. Uh-huh. So let's go ahead and I'll tell you guys the key ingredients on that. It's molasses, cassia, henna, um, Chebe powder, and Rasul clay. I used this in me and Afro Pinionated's um, wash day collab, and I know she did a video on it recently, so go check hers out as well. Of course, y'all know we got to jam out on wash day because what else am I going to do while standing in the shower? So this is what my hair looks like, having that clay gloss all rinsed up out of my hair and everything. So let's go ahead on to our cleanser. Of course, this is the As I Am Dry and Itchy Scalp Care Olive and Tea Tree Dandruff Co-Wash. So if you know me and you follow my channel, I have a very itchy and dry scalp. That's why I like to oil my scalp. And this co-wash right here is formulated specifically for people with a scalp like mine. So of course, I went ahead in with this product and it smells like minty goodness, like <laughs> baby girl, and she's thick. So getting into application, I like to apply my co-washes to the roots of my hair first. And um, most co-washes that I tried at least don't have like a leather. This one, as y'all see in a little bit, it does have a, a very small amount of leather, but not, you know, like a shampoo would. So it's able to spread a bit more. So I like to start at my root and then go ahead, grab more product to add it to my ends. And that's what you guys are seeing me do here. And then if I feel like I need more of the product, be it at my ends or at my roots, I will go ahead and apply. And then I scrub my scalp like I would with a shampoo. So I will say this, um, I've only tried this man, this co-wash and the coconut co-wash from As I Am. I do have one more in my stash and I know they released a couple more since then, but um, I really like this one. I like this better than a coconut co-wash, but it really depends on what you're looking for in a co-wash. Personally, I prefer them to be more cleansing. My issue with co-washes a lot of times is that they're so moisturizing that I feel like my hair isn't always clean. So that's an issue for me so this co-wash definitely gets your hair more clean um and it doesn't leave behind as much moisture as say the coconut co-wash will but that's what i was looking for on this wash day so that's what i went in with just to give you guys a little bit of a heads up because i know some of you guys don't like that also of course i make sure to finger detangle co-washes to me are like a shampoo and conditioner in one and i personally finger detangle with my conditioners so i try to make sure that i'm able to do that with my co-washes as well this one doesn't have the greatest amount of slip but it gets the job done that's how much shedding i had from one section so y'all i went ahead and co-washed around my entire head and when i tell y'all my hair felt so incredibly minty like it just like i love a good tingle <laughs> let me comment down below if you love a tingle as well but as you guys can see my hair looks good but it looks like it needs some moisture and just by feeling it as well you can tell it definitely is in need of that so I went ahead in with one of my recent favorites. So this is the Kinky Tresses Restorative Conditioner. It moisturizes, nourishes, and strengthens for dry, brittle hair. Kinky Tresses. <laughs> I have talked about this product so many times on my channel, and I just tried it at the end of last year. I think this is like my third or fourth video mentioning them. So Kinky Tresses, if you are watching this, hit up your girl read your emails open your dms because we need to chat <laughs> so 
I went ahead and sectioned my hair. Y'all know that I typically do not apply my deep conditioners in the shower at all, but I just wanted to do something quick and different for you guys today. And of course I wanted to share it. So I'm grabbing some of the product and um, y'all, it takes so little of this product. It's amazing. And y'all will see my face when I apply it. It feels so just like instantaneous slip moisture, like girl like it just really does it all for me so you guys will see all by my facial expressions that i absolutely love this mask it always does what it needs to do and the shine after the mask i mean i don't look for shine personally my deep conditioners but it is definitely an added bonus and this this treatment definitely does it i mean what else do i need to say so I'm going ahead in and I'm taking my sections in sections, of course, like I typically do because I tend to miss the insides of my hair because I'm, you know, clumsy, but I'm gonna go ahead. I am literally just in love with this mask. So you guys are just going to see me apply this mask a little bit more. And shout out to Melanin Hair Care for the shower mirrors because I didn't know I needed one until I bought it. So I'm going ahead, I'll put my plastic bag on after I finish my hair and everything and I'll be right back. So y'all, I am back and I'm sorry about the lighting. It kind of got washed out with the shower, so I don't know. But as y'all can see, the hair is giving and I am very much excited and very much happy with the products that I picked for my wash day. From the clay gloss to the co-wash to the restorative conditioner, it just really, really did it for me. Y'all can see that the curls are curling and my hair looks happy and healthy. So, I mean, what else, what else can a girl ask for? But you guys, that is the end of this video. Please make sure to comment down below some of your favorite wash day um, combos because y'all know I am down to give them a try. I love you guys so, so much and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.